Hello everyone, this is Alex Bavolsic from HowToDoTech.com, and today we're going to be looking at different viewing types in Windows 8 and Windows 7. Now, this will work for Windows 7, I'm just going to be using Windows 8 for the demo. Um, there's really tiny changes, but other than that, it's basically the same. And what we're looking at in general is different viewing types for Windows. Now, in Windows, 8 and Windows 7 we have tons of different viewing types as seen here and we can even choose um, a variation on these in Windows 7 maybe you have large icons but they're a little bit larger than just plain old large icons but a little bit smaller than extra large you can get in between Windows 8 we just have these six right here which is perfectly fine there's quite a lot to choose from now the problem with Windows is if I go to different folders, this isn't really unified. Under local disk C, I'm showing details. Under downloads, I have large icons. Under desktop, I have tiles. And then, you know, under my music library, I have details again. And it's not really unified. However, this can be fixed in a couple different ways depending on how you want to do this. Now, the first way to fix this problem would be the best for unifying files on your PC itself. And that is to come up with a general option for all of your PC to view. And to do that, all you have to do is go to your local disk and then from here choose the viewing what viewing type that you want. For large icons is going to be mine. Now I'm going to go to options. In Windows 7, you're going to have to hit organize then options on the left. From there, you can go to view and then hit apply to folders. It's going to ask me if I want to apply to all folders that match this type. We'll get into types in a sec, but I'm going to hit yes. Now from here, this is large icons, downloads is large icons, um, SkyDrive is large icons. Things that will not be uh, changed by this are different types of libraries and the desktop. Libraries in the desktop have their own way of viewing these. Um, I've set pictures to large icons by itself. You can still change it. It's just not going to be affected by the general settings because it's a library, not a just plain folder. So now let's, so now go let's into talk something. about the viewing types for individual folders. So maybe I like large icons for overall, but say my pictures folder, I want that to have extra large icons, not just large icons because I want a better preview. Changing this is going to be a little bit harder because it's not as user friendly and the wording on options can get a little confusing if you don't know how you're doing this. So first we're going to want to right click on the largest folder containing where we want to change the look of things. So if I want to change all of my pictures I'm going to start by clicking the my pictures folder. From here I'm going to go to properties and then customize. Now I want to optimize this folder for pictures. This is already set as the preset because it's my pictures folder. But if I was say under the SkyDrive folder, it would be set for general items and I would have to change it to pictures. I'm also going to want to apply this template to all subfolders. Now you're going to notice right now I still have large icons. So I'm going to click extra large icons. But the thing is this still hasn't went through to the entire folder and you're probably like oh no Windows has failed me what do I do now actually you're gonna want to hit options again and then from here you're going to go to applied folders make sure you are still under the pictures folder when you do this and you're gonna hit apply to folders now here is the loophole in the wording all apply to folders of this type don't forget we changed the type to pictures not just general items so if I apply this to folders all pictures folders so now wallpapers will have extra large icons however if I were to go back to my user folder this is still under general items so it shows it as large icons now normally this would be perfect you would be able to customize folders as much as you want and their subfolders however there is a problem if I go to properties and customize you will notice there are only a certain amount of types you can have. General items, documents, pictures, music, videos. I recommend finding your five different favorite ways of viewing folders and figure those out and assign them to each different category. And then from there you can just assign certain categories to certain areas. 
So we really hope you have enjoyed this video. It is a little more complex than usual. So if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down in comments below or email us at howtodotechyt at gmail.com. Feel free to also leave us suggestions for future videos in the comments or on that email. And then go to howtodotech.com to see if we've already done a video about your question because we have tons of tutorials there. Also, you can subscribe to the channel to be notified when we come up with new videos. And then please don't forget to like this video and show us that you learned something because that support really does help us. Um, finally, there is a link down in the description below for a tutorial for you to refer back to. It is a written tutorial on our website. And if you're all satisfied now, you could click one of these five topics to be brought to a playlist where we have more videos for you to enjoy. So I am Alex Bavulsic and I will see you next time.